Not all dogs in the world are as nice as my dog Dave, who I rescued from a Korean meat dog farm. And he is every day grateful for me going to pull him out of that cage. But you know, um, dogs come to me from all sorts of backgrounds, uh, some good, some bad, some perfect, some very imperfect, with all sorts of behavioural problems. And it's the same the world over. And the most common behavioural problem that dogs present is that they're aggressive, aggressive to dogs, to people, maybe to, uh, to farm livestock. And we have to use a, a balanced training approach. By balanced, I mean we have to do the carrot and stick approach. We have to use payoffs, pretty obviously treats, and we have to use penalties. Well, we might use just a looking away, a walking away. So social isolation is a punishment. In others, it may be dropping an object, like a soft drinks can with a pebble in it. But for others that are a bit more, if you like, resilient and confident, it'll be the pet corrector. Now, the pet corrector itself isn't scary. It just is an interruptive device, and it's based, of course, upon the same principle that are used by snakes and certain insects, and lots of geese, that you make a shh sound, and that gets the attention of other animals. And that's the only basis for the effectiveness of the pet corrector, which dog trainers, behaviorists the world over, think it's a miracle device. It does change behavior, but only when used in combination with rewards for good behavior. I'm doing a home visit to see Karen and her lovely dog, Piper. Now, three months ago, Piper was very aggressive, like dangerously aggressive towards other dogs. Karen, this has been fantastic. It's three months since I saw Piper, and what a change. Oh, people have commented, yes. Yeah, fantastic. yeah, okay. So it's the power of treats, payoffs, and pet corrector. Carry on as you are. You're taking all the responsible precautions of using the muzzle, you keep her on the lead, but you walk towards dogs now, you don't avoid them. And that's an, the other key change in the strategy that we've worked out together, yes? It's transformed our walks, really, because I used to be tense as soon as I saw a little dog, and now it's fine. And she's getting the chance to do what she needs to do, which is to interact with other dogs in a friendly way yeah. and learn there's nothing to be afraid of. Okay. Relearning her social skills. Yes. Good girl. We use treats, a reward-based system, and we use the pet corrector, only occasionally, uh, which emits a noise, and if she starts to behave aggressively, then I just catch her with that noise, aim at her rear end, that distracts her, and she's changed her mood and is relaxed. I'm delighted now, because uh, my dog has a chance to mix with other dogs and have fun with other dogs, and that's something that I couldn't give her before. Really happy.